you. Come on up. Thank you. Uh, my heart at ease. It was published uh, in uh, May of this year, so it's pr pretty brand new yet. And I did challenge myself to write 100 poems in the year 2021. And um, so uh, my wife thought I was a little nuts, but I, I, I did do that. Um, so I'm going to read just a few short poems, and they're, they're very short um, poems. I'd like to thank Tom, too, Tom Cannon, who did the forward for this. He was very gracious in uh, lending his time and wrote a beautiful forward to the book. So very honored to have the Oshkosh Poet Laureate do that. And Tom has also given me inspiration, given the community of North Fond du Lac inspiration, and that we are right now in the process of developing a Poet Laureate um, which would be um, voted on by our library. So we're very excited about that. Thank you. Thank you, Tom. Okay, I have so many poems to pick from here. This one is called Tilted by Prayer. Now tilted in prayer, humbled by the river. Awareness now shifts. I am shaken by a shiver. Mesmerized by nature and its powerful current, knowing the true essence, knowing what's urgent. I turn my head to the stars, and what do I see? A brilliant display, a wonderful tapestry. Moonlight reflects off the river's edge. I'm careful not to step off the ledge. Beauty reigns on this river tonight. As I pause to reflect on this wonderful sight, I talk to the sky and question the meaning. Is there a purpose and someone intervening? Tilted by prayer. My next one is called Dancing with Emily Dickinson. If I met Emily Dickinson, I'd ask her to dance. I'd ask her a question. I would take a chance. I'd ask her how lovely the sky is today. I'd tell her to explain it in her own particular way. I would study the way she would prance about. I would marvel at the way she moved in and moved out. Total access to this gold-plated poet, a treasure in front of me, not even knowing it. I might see myself in her eyes. I can't hold back. There is no disguise. Poetry is the future, and the future is bright. I might be wrong, but I'm probably right. Dancing with Emily Dickinson. Okay, this one is called The Sands of Time. Time running out, shout your last shout. Make it good this time. Make it scintillate and rhyme. Make it colorful, make it loud, make it epic, make it, make it proud. Take it up top, take it down low, take it where you want to go. The hourglass, clear warning, this is where our souls are soaring. Make it a great, make it great, make it your last stand. Standing proud, an honest and caring man. Sands of time. One last one, this is the... Uh, Last poem of the book, it's a quick poem, called Transition. Loved one, when you transition to the other side, on your love, can I still confide? You have broken through to the promised land where life and truth eternally stand. Trying to break away from my feelings tonight as I hold your love tighter than tight. Your ghost is close, I feel it near, as we on earth continue to persevere. O oh, love of mine, separation is not kind, because earth and heaven cannot bind. But I feel you close in the summer breeze, and your love still sets my heart at ease. And I do have copies of my book called My Heart at Ease. Uh, they're eight bucks if anybody wants one. I've got extra copies tonight. Thank you very much. Thank you. Appreciate it.